What I do? I need your driver's license and I'll explain it to you. I'm working on it. No, what I do first? Uh, why you pull me over? You get your driver's license and no, I'll explain what I put, it. What do you pull me over for? Tell me that first. Sir, let me explain something to you. And what's your... I know, I know, I know the law. No, you have to tell me Truth why me. you pull me over. I don't, I don't have to tell you. I have driver's license. I have to identify you first. No, you don't. You have my tag number right back there. Are you J Troop or K Troop? Who are you? Proof no, what did you pull me over for first? Sir, you can be difficult. Or I you do can a white. I'm not trying to be difficult. You I'm just telling difficult. you. I'm not. And you're also. Anyway, I'm just asking why did you pull me over first? I did one wide open throttle. I'm a diagnostic mechanic. And you also pulled my son over the same thing, too, Caleb Miller. You saw me at Roses one time with an open carry weapon. I'm just asking, and I know Jamie Atkins and all the bunch, whatever, but why did you pull me over? Why? Need to do that first. The no, you have my, have my tag number. You can run it and get my tag number. tag number doesn't mean it comes back to the driver's vehicle. It does show the insurance, though, on the thumb. That's, that's correct. No, but, but tell me why. You have to tell me why you pulled me over. You haven't identified yourself yet. I see a uniform, I see a vehicle. Okay. Why did you pull me over? I did a wide open throttle. Real quick, I'm a diagnostic mechanic. I'm working on a truck. And I'm heading toward a guy's house to help me with it in Columbia. I am listening. No, you don't have to explain. That's a cop's plane. No. no. I need to identify who I'm speaking with. I'll explain to you why. I am Robert B. Henschling. My birthday is 622-62. I own this truck. And I have registration and everything. You don't have to know that. Tell me why you pulled me over. Mr. Henserling insists that Trooper Miller is obligated to inform him of why he has been stopped before he surrenders his driver's license. But he does tell the trooper his name and date of birth and admits to owning the vehicle. In general, police officers must have reasonable suspicion of a traffic violation or criminal activity to pull over a vehicle, but they are not legally obligated to inform citizens of the reason for traffic stops, although it may be policy or standard practice for many departments. In fact, in the 1996 case of Wren v. United States, the Supreme Court held that the actual reason an officer pulled over an individual is irrelevant to the constitutionality of a traffic stop. The court explained that, quote, not only have we never held that an officer's motive invalidates objectively justifiable behavior under the Fourth Amendment, but we have repeatedly held and asserted the contrary. We think these cases foreclose any argument that the constitutional reasonableness of traffic stops depends on the actual motivations of the individual officers involved. In other words, as long as there existed some objective reason that would warrant conducting a traffic stop, the stop is considered to be constitutional, regardless of the real reason the officer pulled an individual over. Conversely, while officers do not have a duty to explain the reason for a traffic stop, Drivers are legally required to display their license upon request to a police officer. Section 63-1-41 of the Mississippi Code states that, quote, Every licensee shall have the required license in his immediate possession at all times when operating a motor vehicle, and shall display the same upon demand of a peace officer. There is no contingency in the statute that requires officers to prove to the driver that they had a reasonable suspicion to stop them for this obligation to apply. And therefore, Mr. Henserling was legally required to display his license to Trooper Miller. If Mr. Henserling believed that he was pulled over unlawfully, the best course of action would have been to comply with the demand to display his driver's license and challenge the validity of the traffic stop in court if he was charged with an offense. He could also express his concerns about a baseless traffic stop by filing a complaint with the Mississippi Highway Patrol. 